Oh my god, that was so annoying. I'm very disappointed in you, Franbo. I'm very disappointed in you. The fact that I had to go through and do that so far into the development cycle of this game. God, it's been out for like years now. Whatever. Whatever. We fixed it. We fixed it. That's what matters. Alright. Okay. So now we can actually play this game. Now I can actually see what it's all about. Okay. There we go. Alright. God, I've been wanting to play this game for like forever. And... Ew, you ripped all your fake nails off? That sounds terrible. Hang on. I'm gonna see if I can't move this to the other monitor. Okay. I'm gonna move that there. And full screen now. Man, it always does that. Okay. And there we go. All right. Here we go. <sighs> Here we go. We're gonna start it now. Glue residue? Ew. Okay. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna start the game. This has been a long time coming, guys. I've been very excited to try this game. Okay. Everything's fine. It feels like heaven. I see my parents. They look happy. They have a present for me, I wonder. It's a cat, so sweet and pretty. Ooh, kitty. Dark as the deepest night. It's a Mr. Midnight. My best friend. My only friend. Oh, that's sad. We were having dinner, and I see Aunt Grace, too. I really like her a lot. It's Friday. My parents are going out. Aunt Grace takes good care of me. We're having so much fun. It's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. But something feels real bad. Whoa! <laughs> it does look bad. A strange creature outside my window. I don't like it. It scares me. Suddenly, I hear something. It's Mom screaming. I want to know what's wrong. A bright light shines from my parents' rooms. I go closer. Oh, don't go in there! No! Not a good idea! And closer. Really not a good idea! It, it wasn't a good idea. Oh, Mom? Dad? Please don't. Oh, God! Jesus! Mommy? Daddy? Oh, my God! He's missing an eyeball! God, it's a bloodbath. Oh, the cat's hugging her. Mr. Midnight. Hey! No, no, he's getting scared away. Don't leave, friend. Oh, boy. What? There's a hooded person taking me away. Friend, please follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. One. Two. Oh. Oh, we're back to reali reality? Three. Friend, how do you feel? Uh, I'm fine, I guess. 
Just sad to see the same things. Sadness is something everybody has within. I want to go home. You can't go home, Fran. You have to get well. I, I think I'm institutionalized right now. I'm not crazy. But I'm not crazy at all. Let me out. You know, we cannot do that. But now I have something for you, friend. Oh, really? See the desk? There's a little package for you. Ooh! I'm getting a gift. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. I wonder what she gave me. Oh, okay. So it's pretty much all just point and click. Gotcha. That was my mother's purse. I wonder what's in it. Open it. There's something inside. Open it. There's some... Okay. Uh, lost in... Huh? Use? I can't use this. Maybe I should examine it. Examine. Dearest friend, here's the purse you like so much. I thought you would like to have it. When I was thinking about you, I remembered that you like to examine objects and combine... <laughs> what a weird way to give a tutorial. So I hope you'll always keep this purse and you give it all the other, um, the other things you find a good use. Never forget that creativity is absolutely the greatest gift you have. Love, Aunt Grace. Yeah, I know a good bit of it, but there's still a lot of mystery for me, okay? Uh, she's worried about you. Aunt Grace? Well, another reason to let me go. Well, don't worry about her. She is fine. Can I leave now? Yes, you can leave, but before you do, it is time for your new medicine. Nah, I think I'm done with medicine. I'm pretty sure I'm done with medicine. I don't want to try more medicine. It's called Duotine, and it will make you feel very relaxed. Nurse, we're ready. I'm not. I'm just gonna go this way. Anything new today, Dr. Dearn? <laughs> Dearn. <laughs> Nothing, actually. Some, uh, same visions as before. Oh, I see. Here, friend, take your medicine. Now, I'm just gonna go at everywhere but there. And... Oh, he's not letting me go. Damn it. Oh, welcome back, Reese. Alright, alright. I'll take your stupid pills. Fran, you okay? I don't feel good. What did you do to Fran? Oh, God! No! <laughs> All right. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, no. Take her back to her room. And nurse, don't let her take this ever again. Uh, yeah. You said it'll make me feel relaxed. I think I saw hell just now. <laughs> Beware, friend Bo. If you leave the house of madness, I will hunt you down. There's a, there's a deer man looking for me, apparently. Catch you. And bring you back to insanity. I'm pretty sure I'm already in the grips of ins- Ah, oh, she's bleeding tears. Friend, wake up! The medicine will help you escape. I'll be waiting for you in the forest. I'll see you there, Mr. Midnight. I'm on my way already. I lo oh, he loves me. My sober day. I don't think I'm going to be sober. I don't think I'm going to be sober. I think they're going to make me take the duotine again. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Get up, friend. Come on. It's time for adventures. Adventures. I'm still here. Hideous place. I have to get out of here. I agree. I agree. Mr. Midnight awaits. Let us go, friend. Okay. What is this? Oh, sweet, sweet melody. It is kind of pretty. Look at the clown. I will get your nose. I will get it. Ah, uh, you're you're an odd person, friend. I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> okay, friend Bo Dickenhart. Uh, the patient was found near the Oswald Asylum, showing signs of psychosis. The Bo Dickenhart family tragedy. Uh, details omitted. Treatment. 
Dr. Marcel Dearn has tried different medications and all have been canceled because of side effects. Oh, God! Something fell. Ah, uh, because it's the cat in my mind, specifically. A handy hook. I'll save it to play pirate later. Good idea. Good idea, friend. I like that you're thinking outside the box. Maybe if we pretend to be a pirate, they'll let us go to sea. I can still rock around and see what's going on on the other side. Alright, alright, alright. We're going, friend. Don't get mad at me. I'm sorry. Nurse? Oh, I want to know what she's writing. I'm curious. Can I see what you're writing? I guess the, the nurse would never let me touch anything. I know that nurses always keep the medicine, but where? Oh, friend, you're awake. Good. How long was I asleep? Three day- THREE DAYS?! The hell did you give her, cocaine?! What is, uh, what is the medicine? Yes, it was the medicine. That's why you are not taking it anymore. I did something. Lady Nurse, I did something. What did I do? I don't know what I did. See, you are nothing but trouble. What is it? I broke the curtains. <laughs> Pff, accidentally. I have to fix this. Follow me. With my macne? What? Empty bottle, empty glasses, nothing useful. I'm curious, yes, but the nurse is still inside this room. Damn it. I, I guess I need to follow her. Okay, let's go. Something is missing. Have you seen the hook that holds the curtains up? What's a hook? <laughs> uh, what's a hook? Well, I have to go and find something to fix this, you little girl. Yeah, you get out of here. You're, you're a mean nurse lady. I don't like you. <laughs> okay, let's go. Okay. What is this? I want this. Band-aid. Good, good idea. Good idea. Okay. Uh, what is this? Oh, well, I don't know why I take her a cup of coffee. I don't know why I clicked on it. I'm sorry. I'm stupid. <laughs> Violent trauma can have a great impact on children totally changing their lives. For example, children damaged by trauma can have mild to severe deficits in some, in some abilities, such as trusting people near them, seeing the world as a safe place, making decisions, etc. Because of these effects, some traumas can lead to several symptoms of major mental illness. For example, not trusting other people or not feeling safe in the world. This can be interpreted as paranoia. Gotcha. There's a lot about this world that I still need to learn. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, there's other kids here. I wonder what he has to say. Hello, Phil. Hello. Uh, yeah, let's just cut straight to the chase. You do know the way out, right? There are many ways out. Okay. Uh, thank you, bye! <laughs> okay. Yes, but you know that everything is locked. Indeed, but the office is the key. What do you mean? The office? I saw the doctor write a secret code. Secret code? To open the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. You know what it is? Tell me what it is! Who? Him. Who? What? What is- OH BOY! WHAT?! All doors are closed, you are a prisoner of my games. And nobody will help you escape. <laughs> Leave me alone, I hate you! I agree! Mommy, Daddy, I need you so much right now. He just hit him. Portal. What? 
Okay, we need to... Of course it's locked. What else would it be? Doll! You used to have a blue dress like yours. You used to have a... Okay. Uh... Oh, wouldn't miss your horse. Are you having a good time? Look, it's horse! Okay. Wait, wait, there's a box right there. Oh, a secret box. Shh. Okay. I want to open it. A little box. It's open. Use. A key! Okay. All right. Uh... Well, let's go. Maybe we could use that key to get out of here. Uh, hang on. I got the solution. Use. The key is too tiny. Bollocks! Ah, oh, I, I felt so intelligent for a second. I was just like, wow, there's just a key laying here that allows me to escape the facility. How convenient. Maybe in here? Oh, a key for that. Okay, uh, let's use it for that. Yes, I got it. There's something inside. Uh, there's a bobby pin. And, ooh, okay. It, it's a picture of me! It's a picture of me! Okay, uh, let's go. Okay, let's go over here. Maybe we could use the bobby pin to escape. Don't worry, friend. I know what to do. Use that. It fits, but there are two holes. I need something else. The chair? If I sit down, I will eventually get up. So what is the point? Uh, we can't take that cross. Hmm. Do we have anything? Oh, the hook! Duh. So obvious. Okay. We're gonna use that. That. The shape is not right. Bollocks! Uh. Hmm. What can we go get to open that? There's cro- Don't backseat game, Kay. Don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. Let me see what that is. I can't see through the window. What's this? Empty bottle, no glasses, nothing useful. Bollocks. Okay, come on. There's got to be something here I can use. I don't want to. I just woke up. Jeez. You're very sassy, aren't you, friend, Bo? Okay, um, uh, hmm. Maybe right here? Uh, came to Oswald Asylum with his brother, Rachel, uh, with his mother, Rachel Bronstone. The boy has developed paranoid behavior. Paranoia not yet d diagnosed. Hmm. Maybe this bear know what's to do? I hope somebody loves you. Aw. Friend Bo seems like such a sweet person. Can I? No, why would that work? I ran out of biscuits. Why did you run out of biscuits? Biscuits. Okay. Uh, wait, what? Can I interact with that? Hmm. I have to find Mr. Midnight. Oh, the playground. The bunny swing thingy. She's just talking about things she likes. <laughs> She's so cute. Okay. Uh, let's see. No, I can't go over there. Maybe that. All right. Well, let's take that. What about... Oh, my God. A gun. A gun. Jesus Christ. Whoa. She's crazy. She's freaking crazy, dude. Use. Okay, so I think it's, uh, hide is, H is what letter? Uh, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. That's gonna be eight. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, nine. Four. Up. Oh. Damn it. And A, B, C, D, E, five. There we go. Wait, does that work? Oh, shit, hang on, I gotta call, guys.
All right, I'm back. So wait, now how do I open this thing? Maybe I use the hook? Combine with that. Ah, uh, damn it. Maybe combine with that. Wait, no, what? What's the code? Um, hmm. I can totally figure this out. This is not as complicated as it seems. How do I get out of here? God, I'm gonna die in here. I'm gonna die in this room. Let's see. Actually, you know what? Use on that. Kay losing her patience. Yeah, but what would be the something else? Hmm. Yeah, but hang on. I think it was eight A B C D E F G H I. That's nine. A, B, C, D, E. Weird, it didn't open before. Whatever. <laughs> I could swear I put that in last time, but this time it doesn't know. It just opened on its own. Alright, let's pop the pills. Okay, there's gotta be something else that I can open it with. Can I still talk to him? Why are you looking at me like that? You terrify me. Can I talk to this guy? Phil is playing with his uncle, and the uncle is mad. Mad. Hmm. Hello. Oh, no, your head. Okay. I'll try to put your head back on. I'm sorry, I can't help you, Mr. D. I just broke it even worse. Okay. Let's see. Is that a dead bunny? <gasps> oh, are you sleeping, sweet bunny? I don't think he's sleeping, Fran. Oh my god, it's holding my head! <laughs> Jesus! Oh, is that my head? Give me my head back, please. Just go away, you weird creatures. Okay. Let's go down here, I guess. Wait, how am I actually able to do this? How this is weird. No, absolutely not. You can't tell her that. But she has to know, you can't keep me away from her. The reason is more than clear, Grace. No, it's not. I want to take her home now. You can't. Fran's mental condition is not appropriate yet. What the? There's so many weird things that are happening right now. Was that real? Oh, dear Aunt Grace, I wonder what she has to tell me. That doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Oh no, Foxy Fox, don't cry. Oh, no. It's so sad. She's so innocent. Oh! I guess now. Huh. Okay. Get out, creepy creature. Hello, Miss Nurse. Are you alright? She doesn't look alright, Fran. I'm not gonna lie to you. What about this mouse? You got a little blood on your mouth. Are you okay? Hmm. Let's see. Maybe there's something specifically that I missed with the pills. There's got to be an item here. Wait, this maybe. Who did it? That's a good question. Towels! Towels! I don't need towels. Hmm. Hey, Laga, what's up? Let's 
Let's see. Hmm. Maybe that? Okay, got that. I guess this is how I escape. Uh, alright, so let's go escape now. Because we can actually exit this room, finally. Uh, use the pills again. And we're gonna get that. Yeah. Use on that. And now we're gonna... This is a psychological horror game. She, um, her parents were found dead inside of, uh, in, inside of her house. And she got locked into a men, uh, mental institution. So she's trying to escape to find her cat. It's very, very strange. Wait, what? I just, I just used it though. Oh, you want me to combine it, don't you? Combine. There. Alright, there. There we go. Alright, now we're, we're gonna escape. It's it's really cool. I like the game. Oh! You should be in your room. The door was closed. Opened it with my key. I should probably not say that. You left it open. I'm sure it was not open. I know because I locked it. How did I get out then? Don't try to trick me. Go inside your room and wait for the doctor. Aw, she sent me back. Damn it. Alright, I have no time for this. I have to find my way out. Oh, the doctor's here now. Did you break out from your room? That's not nice, friend. My kitty told me to leave! Uh, I haven't eaten in days, yeah. But I'm hungry, sir. I haven't eaten in days. I won't listen to any of your excuses, young lady. But I'm gonna die! <laughs> Alright. Uh, I'm not making up excuses. You have to learn how to listen to those in charge. Lesson learned! <laughs> you big people! <laughs> of course, sir. Lesson learned. Just don't do it again, friend. Go and eat now, then get back to bed. Yay! I lesson learned. Okay, now I can actually escape. Now, uh, what's in here? Whoa! Hey, pal, how you doing? Hello. You see them, you do, right? What? See what? The creatures that follow everyone. The shadows? Uh-huh, I can't see them, but I know they are there. You know what they are? Yeah, I guess. What are they? Tell me, please. You like to draw? I like... What? Beat the um the W R the were by one second. What's that? Uh okay. I love it too. But tell me more about the sh yeah. Stay on topic. Crayon, a crayon. I want to find a crayon. I draw all the time. I want to find my cat. Nah. What are you drawing? Oh, world record. Damn. Nice. Awesome, Lega. What are you drawing? Uh, what is it? My dreams. Go now. Uh, uh. Whoa, my God. What the hell? It's got tentacles. Uh, why do you look like a fabric doll? What have they done to you? Please, somebody tell me something. Tiny, tiny hands all over eating your soul. What the... The, I just noticed that the chair is rocking on its own. Even the purest of things die in play. Even, okay, okay. Let's let's see what this is. Why is the chair rocking on its own? It's not telling me. Damn it. What's that? I don't want to touch it. It's the clown from the painting. That is so creepy and weird. Okay. Uh, oh, let me see. A red puppet and a serpent. Maybe I can go in there? Oh, real flowers. They smell so sweet. The drawer is empty. Damn it. 
That's mine, my crayons. Can I have it? No, I won't be able to draw green then. That's ridiculous. But you have so many! Yes, many colors, but you know, they don't like me drawing. What? Who? The nurses, they tie me up and when I want to draw, I can't. Me too, sometimes. When I can't draw, I hurt myself. Then comes the red milk. Look! Jesus Christ, kid! Oh my god. Please cure me, yes, and stop the red milk. I'll see what I can do. You got it. Uh, I know what to do. I know what to do. You want it. There you go. Oh, thank you. You can have the crayon now. Uh, now go. I have to draw. Oh, okay. All right. Well, I mean, I got the crayon. Uh, Adelaida Fugans. The patient was a victim of sexual abuse by an unknown person, which almost killed... Jesus Christ! This event has created auditory hallucinations and thought disorder. Oh my god, that is horrifying. She's only seven. The water closet? Why are we looking at the water closet, Fran? Fran? What the, the? There was a skeleton man! What was that? I don't... The... Oh, okay! That's weird. The king likes drawings. Okay. Oh, look, look at that! You're my beloved friend, Bip Bip Berm. Ooh! You wanna hug me? Try to catch me, Bip Bip Berm. Come here! You can't catch me, it's because you haven't found me, Bip Bip. What? What is... This is so weird. The maze! Whoa, tonight the fog is pretty thick. Hmm. Oh, okay. No problem, Kay. I'm just gonna figure out what I'm doing. What? This wasn't here before? Yet. Yeah. Let's, let's go over here. Wait, what is this? This gate is very locked. Indeed it is! Ooh. Hey. Sir, the key hanging up there, can I have it? Sure, I could give you the key if you give me a kiss? What the hell? Why is he asking a 10 year old girl for a kiss? <laughs> you should kiss your butt. Give me the key. A kiss, are you serious? And then you will give me the key? Sure, come here and sit on my knee. What a weirdo. Why don't you die with a pineapple? <laughs> I hope you die while a giant pineapple grows in your butt. A kiss for the key, what do you say? What a freaking weirdo. He's so creepy. He wants me to sit on his lap and kiss him and I'm like a 10 year old little girl. Oh, hey, what's your deal? Hello, are you all right? What is that supposed to mean? Uh, I wanted to know. Yeah, every free um every freaky old guy in their like 30s and 40s is like some sort of like mustachioed pedophile. <laughs> uh, I don't want to tell. The doctor will cut your head open if you leave. If you don't leave, oh, okay. Just want to know if you feel okay. He likes to eat brains. He already took mine. He ate all of my thoughts. He ate your brain? He will eat yours too. I saw you inside the doctor's office. You were dead. See? That proves it. That proves it right there. Uh, oh no. Then I have to go. I hope you find new thoughts. Bye. Uh. Wait a minute. What the? That kid is wearing a mask. Why is he wearing a mask? Does he hurt himself? Does he like bite himself or something? Hello, are you new here? I haven't seen you before. No. Are you from downstairs? Uh-huh, they think I'm better now. What's your name? Could you please kill me, please? Oh my god! Sure, bang, you're dead. <laughs> oh my god, she's so cute. Thank you, I can't talk now, I'm dead. 
What's it? Uh, the life of a ten-year-old little girl. Hey, wait a minute! Wait a minute! Where are you going? Come back! I'm your friend! Hi. How are you doing? Hey, Annie, how are you? Oh, she's... Aren't you afraid of me? No, why would I be? Because I can do magical tricks and make you sleepy. I didn't know you could! It's, it's cool. I'm liking it. Show you, but it's very scary. It's better if you do it. I'm not a magician. Oh, she looks so sad she's not a magician. I can give you the magical stuff. Really? Woo! Yes, the magical stuff that will make anyone fall asleep. That's amazing! Powerful and grand. Here, as a gift, take it slowly. I, what is this? What is this? Did she just give me Rohifna? How does it work? Alright, how does it work? I have no idea! Thank you, Annie! Thank you! Uh, the sofa made to be sat on. Indeed! Indeed it is! Oh, look at this kid. He's just munching away at... what? What is he eating? Spaghetti. He's just eating spaghetti. Don't disturb me. Go away. I'm eating. Hey, jerk. I just wanted to talk to you. I'm gonna take that. I don't want this. I'm not hungry. I'm gonna take that. I guess if Damien eats the pasta, it can't be that bad. Birdie Bird, I like you. Oh, she's adorable. Give me that stick. I want that stick. I think it's a walking cane, not a stick. Don't touch my sword. It's not a sword. It's a walking stick. I don't know. It was yours. You should bow and speak clearly to me. I'm your king. You are not the king. I'm only the king of the whole universe. Bow to me. Uh, I bow to you. <laughs> Very well, my child. What is the purpose of your visit? He called he called me his child. Why did he call me his child? <laughs> I want your cane, your majesty. What walking cane? Do you mean my sword? Yes, your highness. What would you give me in exchange? Anything you need, your highness. Bring me a castle and a horse. Only then will I grant you my sword. A castle and a horse. Hmm. Okay. How do I get him a castle and a horse? Why don't you get some food, friend? You're probably starving. I don't like bitter coffee. Friend, you're probably starving. Maybe you should get some food. Oh, what does this nurse have to say? Hello. Oh, hello, friend. How are you today? I see dead animals. <laughs> Jesus, friend. Okay. Uh, we'll just go with fine. I'm fine. Glad to hear you're fine. Carry on now. Can you open the yellow door? That's not very appropriate to ask. I think you should go to your room now. I just woke up. I'm not tired. <laughs> then go do something other than bother me. Uh, okay. I, I guess nobody likes poor friend Bo. Let's, let's go in there. Let's go in there. Oh, this kid is sleeping. Isabel! She won't wake up. Damn it. Hello, what are you doing? It, does, it doesn't work. The paper is not working. What do you mean? The paper should be working like they told me. What does the paper do? I need the paper to show me what's on the television. Why isn't it working? The waves must be powerful. Change the channel, please. Okay. How about now, pal? Still not working. Paper vision negative. Change again. Okay. 
Human testing approved. How about that, pal? We are losing the waves. Change channel. Uh, does he actually want the waves? What is wrong with you? That? You oddball. What do I do? You, you, you want an ant on a... On a tree? Oh my god. <laughs> that? It works! It works! A miracle! Thank you! Paper vision posit- Can I see? No, this is mine. If you want, you can take the papers that didn't work. Okay. I'm busy! Paper vision revision in action! <laughs> oh my god, he's so weird! Give me the paper. Okay. I think he wanted me to draw a horse. So let's combine that with that. Haha! -ha! There. Now he's got the horse that he wanted. That's elephant, sir. You are very pink and soft. Does anything happen in this room? Oh, oh God! What is... Why? Wake up, Isabel. The black shadow is touching you. It says that you're going to die soon. Are you afraid of death? Hope not, because it may happen even if you don't like it. My god, this is morbid. Oh no, they did it all wrong. They cut your head into little pieces. Oh god, all the channels are like this. This is some Silent Hill shit. Get me out of here. Oh god, the teddy bear! The teddy bear! What? What? Oh god, no! No, the teddy bear! Teddy, what are you doing here? Are you on your way to meet another teddy? Say hello for me when you get there. Mr. Teddy, this is terrible. <laughs> what is this? I will laugh at you. I will lie to you. I will hide you inside the... I will... Okay, I'm out of here. Whoa! He's hugging the little kid. And the nurse is dead! They hide you because they love you. Oh no, the lady nurse died! This is so morbid and messed up. Oh, hey, Doodles, what's up? How are you doing today, Minikit? It's going very frambo! <laughs> that holy man took all your clothes off. Oh god, are they telling me his backstory? Is that why he's locked up? Because he got molested by a priest or something? What the hell? What the hell? This is so messed up. Where is my castle and horse? I have your castle and horse. That doesn't help at all. That, okay. I got it, I got it. Here. Have the horse. There you go, pal. Oh, that's beautiful. Exactly what I dreamt of. What is this game? This is called Fran Bow. It's a psychological puzzler. The story goes so far um, is that my um, my parents were found dead inside their house by me. Uh, and, uh, and then I ran out of the house freaked out. And um, then uh, the, the um, I got caught by a whole bunch of adults, and they took me to this mental in uh, mental institution. I'm I'm trying to escape right now so I could find my black cat, Mr. Midnight, and my aunt Grace. Those are the people I'm trying to go find by escaping this place. So I'm trying to get tools to help me escape, and now I got this guy's sword, which doesn't look much like a sword, but it's apparently a sword. I also have these pills called duotine that do this to me. That's what duotine does to me. Okay, let's get out of here. Got the... Okay, there's a creepy guy that's going to be waiting for me right... Oh, hey, Annie, Annie, wait, Annie, Annie, where are you going? Annie! Oh. There's this really creepy guy right here. That wants me to sit on his lap and wants me to kiss him, even though I'm only a 10-year-old girl. 
So he's a freak. Are they infinity? Yeah, the pills are infinity. Yep, that's uh there's this freak right here. I'm trying to get a hold of this key. He wants me to kiss him. But I know what to do. Look, girl, if you keep coming here, I won't be able to control. Oh my god, what a freak! Uh Hmm. Maybe combine that? Okay, never mind. That's the office key. It must be, but how can I reach it? Nothing. I'm not looking at anything. The key. Can I have it? Sure, I could give you the... What a freak! What is wrong with you? Just... Dude, she's like 10. I'll kill you. Good. Good. Stay strong, friend. You are not to be messed with, even though you're only 10. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's see. We gotta figure out a way to get... Hmm. How do we get him? How do we get him out of there? We also need, like, a rope. Where can we find a rope? Coffee, maybe? Let's see. How do we get that guy out of there? We gotta move him somehow. But how do we do it? Maybe in there? Hey, get your hands off the, off the office door. Alright, alright. Chill, you freak. Okay, um, hmm. There's gotta be something else. Wait a minute, look at this. Patient's visits today. Friend Bo. Okay. Phil was here today. Good idea. Let's explore Pills World. Oh, God. Pills World is very strange. Oh, look at this. It's a pig. Hello, Mr. Oink. Ew, a crunchy pig head. Ready to be served. Jesus Christ. Hmm. I know I need... Whoa. Jesus Christ! Alright, let's, let's get out of here and go this way. Maybe if we... Wait, the towels? Maybe the towels have some significance. Mr. Midnight? Oh, no. This, possibly? It's alive! Oh, God. Okay. Uh, hmm. Even in this demented world, she still likes the chocolate. <laughs> Let's see. The spoiled milk? What about the spoiled milk? You can break through every walls with your big muscles and hairy arms. Hmm. There's gotta be something I'm missing here, guys. Uh, put it in the coffee and give it to the guard. Okay. Spoiled milk. Where's the spoiled milk? There. Oh, no, I can't interact with the milk. Spoilers, Kappa. <laughs> no, I, I can't interact with the spo uh, spo- Wait, the signal is weird. That must be because we were so far away. Damn it. Oh. Good guess. Not quite. The other kid has milk? Okay, well, let's go check on the other side. Oh, no. I can't take that either. I can't do that either! I can't! Okay. Well, I guess we gotta keep going. Any! 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 Wait! Wait! Any! Any! Damn it! She told me to pretty much piss off last time I talked to her. 
But I think there might be something upstairs I can still do. Let's go this way. This kid. This kid. No. Damn it. I need a rope somehow, guys. I need to get a I need to get a hold of rope. Going to the pills? Trying to use the pills and then go into the milk? Okay. Damn it. There we go. Um Go this way. That holy man took all your clothes off. Oh man. Well, no, that's just talking about how that kid was mol uh, molested. Jesus Christ, this game is morbid. Maybe? No. Still can't do it. It actually completely makes the milk disappear. There's gotta be something else. Hang on a sec. Hang on a sec. I got an idea. Maybe if I go right here. No. Talk to the nurse? Alright, let's talk to the nurse. Friend, I told you, go mind your own business. I'm very busy. Well, shit. Okay, okay. Yeah, I think it's upstairs what I'm looking for. Wait a minute, hang on. Maybe here? That thing? I haven't interacted with this. No. Nope. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Maybe my room. That? Now I can look outside. Maybe here. Oh yeah, they've just they're just holding a disembodied my own head somehow. I don't it, Okay. Maybe No, that's just my own cat taunting me while on a unicycle for some reason. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Um well let's go back downstairs then guys, and we'll go through here again. Maybe <laughs> I would never attack him with it. Let's attack him with this. Okay. Hmm. If I remember correctly, there was a way for him to say I need coffee. But how do you get him to do that? I think you slipped that pill into the coffee. Oh, oh, there we go. Aha! It was so simple, none of us figured it out. There. That works too. Now I, I'm gonna drug the shit out of this guy. Okay. Now we're gonna use it on him. Hey! You want a drugged up cinnamon bun? I'm not interested in taking anything that comes from you. Make your life sweeter. Please take it, it will make your life a bit sweeter. I don't care about making my life sweeter, now leave. You don't want it? No, now leave me alone. Are oh, you jerk. Damn it, damn it. Ugh. That was my best idea. I told Marcel about the- oh, wait, she's she hasn't been here before. I told Marcel about the latest delivery, but he hasn't looked at it yet. 
Well, you will catch up soon. Hey, Gladys, would you do me a favor? Sure, anything but bring the cop to the guard. Why not? I can't do it because I have to take care of the... I have other things to do myself, sorry. Friend, what is it now? Can I borrow your magazine? Oh, she's so cute. <laughs> no. I'll go get the coffee. Combine. I should not ruin perfect coffee. I have an idea. I have an idea. A kiss for a key? Yeah, sure. A kiss of warm coffee! Die! Good! Look what you did, you insane orphan bitch! You did that on purpose! Now I have to go and change! God, it's burning like hell! Don't go anywhere, you little shit. I'm gonna go kick him. I'm gonna kick him. Kick him! Damn it. <laughs> I was getting a little bit violent. I'm sorry. I think it's warranted considering he's a freak. Okay, uh... We need to figure out a way to get... Rope. How do we get rope so we could get that thing down? Wait a minute. Yeah! Suck it, you pervert. Okay. Ah, we need rope. Where do we get rope? Hmm. I don't even remember, like, rope being anywhere. Where would rope be, guys? Hey! Annie! Annie! Uh... Hmm. TV room? Maybe that? Oh! Good job, Doodles! Good job! I love you. Now we can go. Combine that. Combine that with that. Damn it! There. Okay. Now we gotta use that. Here we go. Sweet. Alright. Let's get out of here, guys. Let's get out of here. Nice. Ooh, there's a typewriter. Can I save my progress like it's Resident Evil 1? Okay. Uh. No? But why is that here? I hate this bed. I'm not lying down here. I'm sorry, friend. Oh, <gasps> key! Get the key, friend! Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, let's book it. Go! Uh... This key doesn't work here. Damn it! Okay. Hang on. There was another door right here. Can we use it on that? Damn it! Ah! Hang on, hang on. What is this for? Examine. An extra key I got from the office. She's so happy about it. <laughs> okay, um, hang on, friend. No, I don't think that's how we go, friend. Maybe up here, friend, Bo? The water closet. Let's check there. Ah, it doesn't work. The dark side of the office? Oh, duh. <laughs> I'm sorry, Minikit. It was so simple. I already don't like it. 
Oh, the dead girl looks a bit like me. Really? Even though your eyes are open, you can't understand. It sounds like they're talking to me. It's a vent. No, it doesn't look like I can do any- Oh! Ooh. Okay, we got the code. I guess behind this there's a hole. A wind hole. <laughs> a wind- Oh! Hey. He scared me. A forgotten girl with no family or cat will die when the moon arrives. What do you mean? Oh! <laughs> God! Hey! Why would- Phil! Phil, what the hell? Phil, please let me out. I shouldn't scream if they find me in here. I'm in big trouble. Where do I- Where did I put the key? Right here. I got the key right here. There's no door! There's no door in the- Oh! Okay. Look at you, Fran, you little scamp. Look at you go. All right, oh, the wind hole. I guess this is my way back. I wonder, oh, look at her go. Oh, I wonder if Phil knew about this. I don't think Phil really cares about us, Fran. Oh. Oh, that rat really hit its head. I should give it a helmet. <laughs> Can we go up there? No, all right. Well, I guess keep going, Fran. I'll just keep going and going. You go. Oh, be careful, friend. Friend, be careful. Friend, friend, be careful. Friend, friend. Jesus Christ, friend. Oh, dear. Where am I now? I guess I'll have to find out. All right. Come on, friend. Up and at him. Let's do this. No, she's not. She's gonna be fine. A map that will mo oh, that will dance on the floor. Uh. Hmm. What the hell? You really lose your head in this place. <laughs> Damn it, friend. Damn it. You sound like me with the stupid jokes. Door. Okay. Uh, I got the key, though. Nice. Let's get out of here. Oh, shit! If you struggle, you will know what that it was I. I will be in every corner to make you suffer and cry. If you choose to disobey, your cat's life will be marked. Oh, God! She just passed out! Oh my dear kitty, we will be t soon. We will soon be together again. I promise. I miss you, my dear. I miss you so much. Why are you leaving? Please don't leave me, Mr. Midnight. At the end of the maze, friend. No! Don't leave me! Shit! Fran, stop getting knocked out! I fainted again. I wonder if my dreams are true. The monster won't. But if I find the maze, maybe I can find Mr. Midnight. Alright, come on. Up and at him a second time. Let's get out of here. Whoa. What is this? Oh boy. Was that a corpse? Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, what the hell? What the hell, dude? This is turning into some, like, Outlast bullshit right now. Jesus Christ, dude! What in the world? What in the world? Oh, 
Oh, God. It word. Okay. Jesus Christ. The body literally moved and then crawled into the corner. Yay, I can read Kay's mind. Let's get out of here. Yes, I took the new one upstairs. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. If she sees me. Friend Bo? No, I haven't seen her. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What? The key to the cellar? Well, no. And the doctor's office he used to have the key there. Calm down. The key is not here. Sure, I'll let you know if it turns up, but you must calm down. Yes, I'll bring it to you if I find it. All right, bye. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You need to move, lady. Lady, please move. Fran? Fran, how do we get her out of there? How do we... How do we... Wait a minute. What? I can't remember Aunt Grace's phone number. I'll just surprise her when I get home. Oh, you're all skinny. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's let's not be standing next to her. Damn. That looks like a security code that we can put in. Hang on, hang on. One sec. Maybe this will tell us. Alarm code. No, it's all phased out. December 17 equals July 25th. What? A what? I don't know that. What does that mean? What does that mean? If only the key holder could talk. Uh, bollocks. Okay, what do we got? What do we got? Uh, I don't know about that. Hey, wait. No, but if we go over there, she's gonna detect us, and we're screwed. Maybe that? I have to get rid of her. But if she sees me, am I screwed? If she sees me, I think I'm screwed. Put the key back on the hook. Good idea. Okay, good idea, good idea. Wow! Good call, doodles! I love you again. Okay. Oh, the key was here after. I, I better take it back. Nice! Good job! Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, God. How did she not see me? Get me out of here. Maybe the paper I found in the office. Damn it. Damn it. Oh. <laughs> okay. Damn it. Hmm. Not 12-12. Maybe... Hmm... 12... 25? Damn it! 12... 17? Damn it! Add the months and add the dates. 24 and 32. 
What? Hang on a sec. Okay, that's 12, 7, that's 19. And then that would be 42. Twenty-nine. Oh no, I was I wasn't combining those two together. I wasn't combining those two together. I was combining uh seven and twenty-five together, the thirty-two. Nineteen. What? <laughs> <laughs> now I'm even more confused. 19. And. Okay, that's 32. What? Uh huh? <laughs> 19. And 32. You sure? Maybe it's 32, 19. What? Ah, uh, see, that's why. 29 and 32. Aha! Awesome. Let's get out of here. I'm the very best. Specifically, Doodles. Alright, alright, it's time to go. It's time to go. You little bitch, I will make you pay for what you. Oh, God! Get me out of here. What? In the world? What in the world? You little girl, do you think you can just leave? No, no! What? It can't be, no. No, wake up! Wake up, friend! Friend, we can escape! Get up! Come on, we can escape! Go! Go, go, friend! Go, 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 come on. Come on, we can escape, friend. Go to the maze. I will, I will. Ooh, it's like a maze. Okay, let's go. Don't leave me, Mr. Kitty. Don't leave me. Don't leave me, Mr. Kitty! Come back! Mr. Kitty, come back! Oh, shit. Hey! Hey! Wait, you're leading me into a bad- Oh, God! Why would you lead me into that, Mr. Kitty? I thought you were on my side. Come on, go, go, go. Why would you do this to me, Mr. Kitty? No, I'm not gonna follow him anymore. He's gonna lead me into death. He's evil. He's an evil Mr. Kitty. Aha! See? Why would I follow him when I know what I'm doing now? Oh. Wait. Oh. <laughs> okay. Maybe we should have followed Mr. Kitty. Oh, no, wait. Up here, up here. No, those are... Wait, is that it? No, that's not a spot I can go through. Oh, shit, friend! Okay. Mr. Kitty? Is that you? Are you here to help me? Up here? Are you serious? It was just one... L Wait, what? Oh, okay. How do I get out of here? Okay, well, that guy isn't coming my way. Go. Go, go, go this way. Oh shit! No, 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 no. Okay, there we go.
We'll, we'll just wait until he crosses. Wait, no. No, 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 Aha! And now we're out of here. Good. See? I can do it. Friend, what are you... There we go. At the end of the maze, you will find... The evil critters of the night. They will hunt you, they will laugh. But there will always be a good side. A cat full of nuts and bolts. Will always be your guide. Oh, no, 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 my picture! Oh, Screw you guys. I don't need my picture. I have my memories. Well, kind of fragmented, but I have my memories! Curiosity symptoms. Oh my goodness, that was close. I hope the guards don't find the sewer. Oh, what is this place? I hope I find Mr. Midnight soon. I'm sure she wants to know what happened, though. Oh, this instrument is pretty. Seems to be all over her, like, all over her notes and stuff. Like, who did it? I could make something out of this. Alright. Hmm. Let's, uh, let's just start from the weird world. Ooh, look at that! Hey, wait, wait! Oh, Dear, your arm is gone. Good that you're not bleeding. I don't, I, it's, a, it's a teddy bear for any. Ooh, look, look at that. I want the key. Curiosity is damned. Damn you, curiosity. Uh, oh, I like to be curious. Otherwise, how will I learn things? What are you? You are kind of curious yourself. What is the right question, but why should be more appropriate? You're weird. You guys are weird. I want the key. I don't have time to chat, sir. I want the key, that's all. Oh, but that key is in ours, and it's not yours for sure. Just give it to me. Please, just give it to me. I want to know what door can be opened with this. We couldn't care less. This affection towards you is simply none. I'm Fran. <laughs> I'm a person. <laughs> Interesting. Tell us more. You are very honest. I like that. I'm a person. Friend. Pleased to meet you. I had a cat. I, <laughs> I have a cat. Well, I had one. He's missing now. I have to find him. Really? Can I have the key now? Look, person, friend. We came from the south, flying as always. And one of us got curious about this key, and all of us got stuck here. And because of our long hair, we can't get loose. Uh, can I help? So you are also curious. Can I help you? We usually get stuck on trees, but we have something to fix that. A beautiful comb to comb our hair every time we get stuck. Give it to me. This there is a problem. A filthy thief took the comb. Now we are stuck forever. If you find the thief in the comb, you will have the key. Deal? What does he look like? Hmm. It's a rat. A filthy narcissist rat. He took the comb to be beautiful. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We couldn't do much, so we ran away with it. Please find it and free us from curiosity. You got it. Alright. Well, I guess we're looking for a rat. A beautiful rat to be... Bes Whoa. Look at that. Ominously walking in the back. Oh, an axe! An axe! I want the axe. I will be the warrior and savior of things. <laughs> okay. Oh, well, I could try to open and see what's inside. Okay. Ah, oh, it's stuck. Okay. Well, I guess we're going back to normal now. What? Hey! Hey, this is the normal world! We got- we have giant insects in the normal world? I think they're just combining together now. 
Oh, wow, you really are a very big ant. Who's there? Are you real? Ah, oh, you always ask the same thing, always. What do you mean? Of course I'm real. Where did you come from? What? What? What is going on? I escaped, obviously. God, giant ant man. I won't tell, don't worry, but what are you doing here? Bad things happened. Real bad things happened to me, sir, but now I'm looking for my cat. A cat, you say? A black cat! Yes, sir, a black cat with very big yellow eyes. Mr. Midnight. Oh, I see. I'm sorry, girl. Seen him around? Please at least tell me you have seen him around here. It happens to be the cat is eaten. Chewed and... What? Eaten? Eaten? What do you mean? The black cat that came towards me in a hurry. Yeah? I catch it and give it to Beetle Pig. My Beetle Pig is hungry. Oh, my poor Beetle Pig hasn't eaten food in days. The blueberry time passed by and we ate them all. Stop it. Can't you see Mr. Midnight is the only one I have? Oh, no, she's crying. Everything is wrong. Wrong. Oh, little girl, don't cry. I can sing for you if you like. What will I do now? You don't know how it feels to be alone. I do know, yes. I'm the last one alive. Let me help you, yes? I want to die. <laughs> I don't want these feelings anymore. Oh my god! She's completely emotionless when she's saying this. The digestion is not so fast, you know. Maybe he's still alive inside the beetle fig. Make it vomit? Kill the beetle- Oh my god, dude! He is the only friend I have left, but I need the- He's the only friend I have left, but I need the meat. This is a strange land we're in, people. I can do it. Yes. Do it. You can kill the beetle pig, and I, Antonio the Greatest, shall eat the meat. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna- I'm gonna attack the ant. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh god, he's running! I scared him away! Wake up, the pig won't stay still. It seems that shouting and pushing him won't help. Maybe I have to try something more subtle. Get over here! You ate my kitty! Oh, you jerk! Wait. What kind of bird are you? Hang on. Oh, no, he's consistently there. He's consistently there. Hang on. Can I climb up there? No. Hmm. Hey, you jerk! Stand still! Stop running away, beetle pig! I need to kill you. God. Weird. The beetle pig isn't even in the other world. Man, I'm so confused. Oh, you pig. Did you eat my cat? Man! Stand still, I just want to chop your face off. Wait, what is that? Hey, what is that? What? Try something more subtle. Okay, let's see. What should we do, guys? Can I climb this tree? No, I can't do anything with the animal. Hmm. No. Maybe that? A very old uncle tried to blow on one of these. 
He farted all his gases out because it was so hard to blow. Oh, okay. Use the axe on the well? Okay. Alright. Wait, what? Hang on. What? Oh, the, the well isn't even there. Anymore. What a bluff. There's no hole in there. Do I use the... I should make it into a complete door before using this. All my forces united to do something unnecessary. I... Okay. <laughs> hmm. Let's go back. Let's go back. What is that? Nothing? Hmm. Is there anything that I can pick up? Pick the planks? Uh, let's try that, yeah. <sighs> now I can't, I can't take the planks on wood. Maybe no. I don't want to destroy the door. Uh, hmm. A feather. Ah. Didn't even notice it. Okay. Well, now we can get that guy. Okay. Here we go. Tickle, tickle. Ah, the threat is great. Great. Wake up! I think the beetle pig doesn't like the idea of being killed. Oh, I see. But that is completely normal, isn't it? <laughs> I love this game's characters so much. But what should I do? You have to give him the special berries, the blueberries. Mm, there are no berries! You said you ate them all! I shouldn't say this to you, but I have the right connection. Oh. They live inside my house. They have blueberries. My house is in that direction. Be careful. Oh, thank you, sir. Okay. Alright, well, I guess we're going this way. This is... Guys, I am loving this game. This game is freaking amazing. It's... The characters in this game are just so awesome. This must be the ant's house. Okay. Oh, uh, the power of destruction will take it down. Well, I got an axe. Let's use it. Alright, here we go. What's that? Someone forgot to clean the brush. Hmm. This is odd. I thought ants never cooked their meals. Yeah, that's actually a good point. Uh... That? You wouldn't mind if I take a little meat... For those who hunger, yeah, that's actually okay. Can I take more? All right. Well, I don't know if I what I needed that meat for, but I got it now. Let's see what's in here. Oh, blueberries! I want the blueberries. Hey, pal. Wow, you are very rare. They're like living pine. <laughs> Sir, you look so angry. <gasps> oh no! <laughs> oh my God, friend, you're so mean. Okay. Let's see. How do I... The blueberries! Ow, that hurts! Hey! Stop it! Just because I threw your baby onto the floor four times don't it doesn't mean you have to do that. Maybe... 
Maybe use here? Hmm. What'll work here? Damn, I could totally kill him with a axe. I don't know what you're talking about, Franny. I wish I could sleep with my kitty on this bed. Oh, I'm sorry, friend. We'll find your kitty soon, I promise. There is water in the sink. Maybe Sir Ant likes to drown tiny monsters in there. Or maybe he's just a very clean ant. <laughs> okay. All right, let's try Dark World. Whoa! What in the world? You tiny creatures, please don't eat me. Get off the bag, I want it. A pest exterminator and he's dead. Hmm. Here. Yeah, maybe the ants will want it. Uh, come on. There! I knew it. Okay, give me that bag. Okay. Examine. Anti-bug sign. Hmm. The bag is open. Alright, what is this? A rat trap and some card of some sort. Okay. I guess that's what we use to catch the fancy rats. Fancy card. Let's see, let's see. Hmm. So what do we do with this fancy card, guys? Let's examine it. Exterminator. What would I even do with that? That seems kind of useless, to be honest. This has got to be used to trap the rats. What about that? What about that? Underpants? Why does the... <laughs> Why does he have underpants? What a cozy little lamp. Hmm. The Queen of Meat. No. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's try that again. Wait, what's that? No. Yeah, maybe we use a rat trap in there, you're right. Let's try that. Uh, use on this guy. Nice! Hey! <laughs> oh, now the mom is hitting me! Bad mama! Save your baby. Now give me those berries. Got it. Okay. Alright, now let's get out of here. Oh, hey! Wait, wait, wait! Where are you going? Where are you going? Damn it. Okay. Alright, uh, we're back. Uh, I got the berries. Use on this guy. There you go. You like those berries? Ah, I'm glad you do. Oh, God! Oh, God, friend! Oh! oh. Hi, Mr. Fancy Rat. Oh, wait, pick up the door. Wait, there is no door to pick up. What are you talking about, doodles? Doodles! I don't see a door. I can't pick it up. I think you're crazy door knob. Oh, aha! Totally didn't call you crazy. Totally didn't call you crazy. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Fancy Rat. Wait, you are not my cat. Oh, miss, you saved me from misery. Uh. Well, I needed to save Mr. Kitty, which apparently this isn't Mr. Kitty. This is the Fancy Rat. Uh, good for you. Uh, oh, where's Mr. Midnight? 
I assume that you're feeling disappointed. Who are you looking for? My lovely cat. Oh, Miss Lady, I'm not very fond of cats, you know. You're probably not fond of big bugs either now. A big, uh, black one with very big yellow eyes was trying to catch me. Really? You seem to get in trouble often. Wait, maybe he is my cat. Oh, my lady, if he is, then he's the one in trouble now. What, what happened? I can show you. Follow me, please. It's not far from here. Look at his little pitter-pattering footsteps. Come back here. Here we are. Somebody took him, miss. They just disappeared. Be more specific. I wish I could. It looked like the earth swallowed them. What? Earthquake? Or maybe just the maze that's in the other world. If, I mean, uh, the little hole that's in the other world. If there is anything else I can do for you, just let me know. I'll be around. Okay. Let's combine that with that. This is perfect, but the handle won't stay. What? Hmm. Did you steal our hair comb? Oh, the hair comb. The shiny, beautiful hair comb. Give it to me. Alright then, but can you please comb my hair first? Sure, little kitty. I mean, kitty. <laughs> Mr. Rat? Yes. Oh, look at him. He's so fancy. He's so fancy. Thank you, my lady. You are very kind. Now we can do it. Here you go. No, not on Fran, on these guys. Here is your beautiful comb, misters. I didn't know. <laughs> oh, you, Fran the person. You finally did it. Goodbye, doodles. Thank you for your help. Hope the door, uh, the key opens the door you wish to open. Oh, I can already tell. Uh, they were prescribed to me by one of the doctors, and they told me never to take them again, because I passed out immediately after taking them. Goodbye! Goodbye. Oh, beautiful. Goodbye, shiny mistress. Have a nice trip. Okay, I got the key now. <gasps> the rat's dead in this world! Rat, who did this to you? Was it my kitty? Okay. I guess he stays dead until... What? That is so strange. Hmm. How do we get the handle to stay on then? There's got to be something here that'll help the handle stay on. No. Oh no! Hey! I can save you! Worm, bip, bip, look, friend, I'm in danger. Find me alive, find me dead, bip, bip. Find me someday in a golden cage, ver, ver, bip, bip, look, friend, I'm in danger. Ah. Wow, this is a really big ant hill. Hmm. And there's something else in here. Oh, glue. Duh. <laughs> I'm so stupid. There we go. Got it. Alright. We're good to go now, guys. Let's get out of here. Here we go. My own door is locked. 
But I got the key to my own door. Ha ha! Yeah, why, why don't you get some sleep, okay? There we go. All right, let's let's go. What a curious little door. I wonder where it will lead me. Mr. Midnight, are you here? What? Oh my god! Oh, man, she just keeps getting knocked out. Uh, chapter 2, Part 2, Double Personality. What? Why am I wearing a little hat? And why am I inside of a cat's... What is going on? Friend? Huh? What is this? A hat? Mr. Midnight. Oh no, your head, kitty! Wait, just a second. This is not my kitty. What a weird hat. It is a weird hat. Welcome home, beautiful kitten. We hope you like your new bed. Be nice and eat your food. Love, Clara and Mia. Whoa, look at that! Is that my cat? Yeah, they did take my cat. What is this? I have matches to light up the darkness or just for fun. Okay. There's so much cakes and stuff here. Whoa! Hi, ghost lady. Hello? Who are you? Can't you hear me? I'm Fran. Whoa! Oh my goodness, the smell! I won't! I will not forget the dark world. But right now I'm in investigating in the light world. Or the not so crazy world! <laughs> this isn't even the dark world! How could it get any worse? What the hell? Okay. Let's get out of here. Wait a minute. What is that? A secret bottle with a secret inside. I want to see what's in the secret inside. I need a bridge. Oh. This is weird. Oh, a typewriter, and it works. Okay. So many that it makes me dizzy. Maybe that was the door I made, and now it disappeared. I'll have to find another way out. Okay, so now my door is gone, guys. Hmm. Can I take some of the cakes? Friend, you haven't eaten all day. Maybe you should get some food. Okay. I can turn on the sink. I won't sit down. Man, you are just restless. Alright, yeah. Let's go to the dark world, Minikit. They all lead me back here. Interesting, but... I don't know what to do since I'm in the dark world. I guess I can't do anything until I have a bridge. Let's see, what do I have? Now, none of these things would work as a bridge, would they? I need a bridge. Can I take that? Can I take that, 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 
that, that. Yep, I can take that. Can I take that? A pine cone. I don't dare touch it. Maybe it will attack me. Hey, wait, wait, what was that? You heard that? It sounded like a rocking chair. Hmm. Now they just put me back here. And that one's locked, so I can't go up there. Maybe this? Black candles to light up the darkness. That! Oh, a ladder! Oh, cool! Mr. Midnight, where are you? I can't see very well. That. Aha! Okay. Mr. Midnight, are you here, kitty? Meow. <gasps> I'm here for you! Mr. Midnight, don't be scared. I'm here for you. Friend, is that really you? Oh dear, finally! <gasps> I, I, I found my kitty! Oh my dearest kitten, it's me! Oh, friend, I'm so happy to see you. I miss you very much. I had dreams about you. And here you are! Thank you for not giving up on me. I love you, my friend. I love you, too. Mr. Midnight, and I really miss you. Oh, dear friend, how did you find this place? Uh, after those people took you away in the woods, I tried to follow them. But after a while, I got lost, and my senses were too weak to track you. Well, you are just a little kitty, Mr. Midnight. I tried to catch some food to recover, but... Something happened. Somebody took me and put me in this cage. I will open the cage. Oh my dear. I will open the cage. We need to go to Aunt Grace. Friend, I'm tired. I wish everything was just a bad dream. It's gonna be fine. Everything's going to be fine. We just need to get you out of here. Friend, can I ask you something? Sure. Mr. Midnight, what is it? Did you feel my presence in your dreams? Yes, I did. Every single night, Mr. Midnight. What medicine, friend? It wasn't really me talking to you. What? I think somebody was helping us get together. Huh. Okay. Every time I had dreams about you, I felt the presence of something else. A presence? Really? What kind of presence? For what it felt, it wasn't human, but it was a really peaceful and kind that's magic <laughs> that's real magic great to have somebody else taking care of us friend did you hear that did you oh i'll see what it is i'll try to find the key to unlock you all right i love you i'll be back mr midnight i'll be back holy shit don't do that what in the world am i looking at They're two conjoined twins. Oh, you scared me. I thought nobody was living here. There you are. We're, uh, we were waiting for you. Where's your head? What? Everyone in this place is nuts. My head? My head is just in the right place. You, the precious being from the other world. Who would ever believe us? I'm confused. Uh, I'm very confused now, ladies. What are you talking about? Fran Bo, that's... How do they know my name? And your mom and dad died tragically. Very brutal, right? And now you really want to know who killed them, right? You're scaring me. How can you know all this? We just know. We have to. We are part of this world. But don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us. All the time. I wish I were at home with mommy and daddy now. Don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. They won't come back. I should do that, but mommy and daddy will never come back. Drink some tea and eat some cake. It will make you feel better. Who told you about me? Are you scared, little friend? These guys are creepy. A little. It's odd the way I came here and this conversation makes me confused. You haven't asked about your cat yet, Mr. Midnight. That's very odd for a girl who loves a cat more than anything else in the world. And yet, you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. 
Shouldn't it be us trembling in fear of you? I love him. And that is why I'm here. I didn't mean to be rude to you. You want him back? He's my best friend. Yes, please. I really want to have him back. He's my best friend. Before we set him free, tell us about how it is that you came here. It's a long story. I, I escaped from a place. A very ugly place. They open the head to children to find out what's wrong with them. Bill told me a secret and I was clever enough to find a way out. And then I came into the woods and met a giant ant and killed a bug and it was terrible. And then I met a rat who wanted to get his hair done. And then... <laughs> oh my god, Fran. And then I made a door and that door took me here. But when I entered the door, something happened. I don't remember anything else. Ah, and I saw a real pinecone family? That was before I came here. They live in a Mr. Antonio's house. They like berries. And uh, ah, I saw flying ants, uh, insects that got stuck in trees because they have long hair. That was also in the woods. And now I'm here looking for Mr. Midnight. That was some adventure. How old are you, friend? I'm 10 years old. But I have to turn 11 soon. And you? We are 16 years old. Much older than you, so you have to obey us. You can't tell me what to do. You haven't even asked our names. That's not polite. And you shouldn't wander around in a house without permission. Are you stupid? A stupid little girl with no family at all? Hey! You jerks! I'm not stupid and I do have a family. I have Aunt Grace and my kitten. Are you crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. If you don't do exactly as we say, you and your cat will die. Holy shit, dude. Do you understand? You don't scare me. Free my cat now. You idiot, you asked for it. If you don't do what we ask for, bad things will happen to your cat. We will force you to kill him with your own hands. The hell? No, you're evil. And poison, but I'll do whatever you say. Good, now listen to us carefully. We need you to perform a little magic trick on us. Do you like magic? Magic is magical! <laughs> Who doesn't like magic? Anyway, this magic is very powerful. It's tremendous and dangerous. Uh, here's a recipe. Be cautious and precise. Otherwise, terrible things can happen. Don't know if I can. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. Do it yourself. We can't do it. It would kill us. You see, we weren't like this before. We used to be two different people in two different bodies. But how is it that you were like this now? One night, a long time ago, something appeared in front of us. We thought it was an angel, but it was not. He decided that we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why. We have a spell to bring him back, but we will do that later when we are not attached to each other anymore. And show him that he is powerless and he will regret it. I'll try my best. We are going to gather some things you will need for the ritual. And because you have been a very nutty girl, you won't even be able to talk to your cat. You'll have to wait until we come back. You're not the boss of me. Let me talk to him. No, you can't. Oh, you jerks. And friend, do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened with it? Can you, silly, silly girl? <laughs> hey, give me that key. You get back here. Damn it. Well, guys. I'm going to cut it off early today. I got some stuff that I got to take care of. I don't know how to save this game. That's the problem, though. Return to menu. Does this game, uh... Does this game save like this? I don't know how to save this game. How do you save it? Do I save it? Yeah, I'm gonna cut it off early today, and we will resume again tomorrow. Uh, same time as per usual. Yep, we are definitely going to continue this game because I freaking love this game. But I don't know how to save this game and it's scaring me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna internet how to save this game. How do you save it? How do you save Fran Bow? Oh, it saves at um, right where, where you leave off. All right, well then, yeah, that's fine. Good deal. Okay. Well, uh, I'll, I'll see you guys in the um, in the Discord, but I have to cut it off right now. 
I'll be there, Kay. Don't worry. I'll see you in the Discord. Later, Minikit.